Hey there, Aaron, the Zaukal playing ASMT. We're in the middle of King Charles Castle, and the controller I use is the uh, Switch Hori Pad S Pro something. I don't know, with the cap removed on the D-pad. Yeah, so we're done with the multi-castle aspect, but it's not over because there we go. We're going to get downloaded, but there's an error on the way, and there's a whole bunch of nonsense. There's like two segments, and then two bosses. Uh, virtual reality project to EXE. Oh man, this fun times never end, but ooh, this is a harsh reminder about what OS's looked like back in the day. Wait, this is a hive music from Donkey Kong, the second one. You can find some cookies, and it, you can tell this is from the past, because it's not asking for permission five times. Here's a troubleshooter. I don't know why the swamps have that face. It looked like a Garfield character. I think that's expand? No, that's reset? Alright. I made a mistake. The outline demo graphic, I think, looks fantastic. Like, it was very easy to do. Like, it's just the outline of her regular graphics, but the effect is so good. So the pointers don't aim, like they kind of vaguely fly at you, but like they don't like home afterwards. They just kind of go. So that's a reset, and that's a pointer in my face. And now I am, that's a shrinkity. Yeah, you got OK and you got KO. You gotta be careful about that, you know, KO's gonna KO you. But okay's okay. Wow. Can't believe I figured that one out on my own. Right, I need to advance, cause see there, a co becomes co -aid. I said those somehow the worst- Whoa, I'm still a ghost there! <laughs> oh man! Well, not a ghost, uh, a transparent pane of glass. And then we're here in this strange room, in the middle of nowhere. And we need to go from there to this room. So that now we can go on the internet. Can I skip this by pressing start? Yes, I can. All right. And uh, the smart little demo will immediately use the reset door to get a second big red flushed smiley face. Just really, really shy, but still has a winning smile. Good for you. Yeah. Good for you. It's a powerful cursor there. Pretty sure the troubleshooter like shoots like medium-sized bullets, but I haven't let it given the chance yet. What killed me last time? Here. Would it make more sense to do it here? But like you can't do that here. You just die. This place is odd. This jump feels bad. Eh. And, and then I trip. Wait, so you are just plain homing, but it just never worked out? That's just weird. Yeah, no, there's just nothing to do here. I think you need. I don't know, ma'am. This place just feels so bad, like, these jumps, so claustrophobic. Ah, and you need a duck, I think, you absolutely need to duck here, no, yeah. I guess that's why maybe there's a shrink icon before, you're expected to get shrunk, but I want to keep my hit, though. Like, there's danger afterwards, but maybe, uh, hmm. There we go, there's a projectile from the troubleshooter. Big ol' fist. Alright, shrink me, Captain. Let's do the small. Like, I've got a spare head up there. Cause yeah, like, this is actually doable. When you're small. Here I missed everything in the universe, because- Ah, it's just, this is a level made of awkwardness. Ah, whatever. So what have I done exactly, other than clearly 
Oh, that was a stupid waste because I'm gonna get reshrunk right here. There's a big hand that I think is supposed to do something, but ugh. But I've never seen it do anything. Like, I think there was supposed to be a gimmick. Like, I remember reading after the fact that you're supposed to get all the cookies to go past that hand, but that never worked. And I'm glad it never worked, honestly. Alright, so... Uh, no, so, yeah, so I can just go here. split apart for me. Thank you for being a curtain. Alright, that was something I dealt with. Alright, a bunch of T's here. Big X, ghost, get punched. Yeah, I just kind of jumped into that one. Let's be, let's be, let's be fair here. Like, I kind of like the level made of these weird segments. I don't care much for, hey, I'm just gonna introduce a bunch of homing bullets old style that's bad how about that I could do without it's, it's just like they come in waves it's like I'm playing that one fortress level in a uh, revenge of Alcatraz in a cave world oh, this one you're even gonna have a roof over your head you do not know Can I... oh there's something that kills me up here and that's cool thumbs ups for everyone Up no good. Well, I got a solution to that. It's a Pac-Man ghost. You know, because of all the times I played Pac-Man. Alright, so there's no cursor ambush in the large troubleshooter area. It's once we get here. It's a more cramped, like, brain type maze. With the, like, reset squares everywhere? I'm not sure I understand that one. I'm not sure why that's reset. Like, what is that icon? Like, I recognize, like, the X. Like, that's the corner of every window, even in buildings now. You know, to just, like, shut things down. Like, in buildings, you know? In buildings, you can shut things down sometimes. Did you know that? Like, sprinkler system and refrigerator units. All gotta get down. So, yeah, don't try to be sneaky. Well, now there's just ghosts everywhere. There it says, Raffle Law! These are so cool. I think the behavior is from, like, also I get, like, all Matrix mode. It's kind of neat. I think this is Rip Van Fish behavior, who also... I, I would love, like, get at least one life back. Alright, hey, totally worth it. Matrix style. But we're not done. Here's a section I made, which I think is pretty cool, but like always, I went overboard. And the ending result is not super fun, but then I just die in a really dumb way. That doesn't mean anything. Whoa, look at me now! And then yeah, after like... Being very mythonautical. You end up at the section where you kind of have to hurry and stuff. Good. Hey. Actual profit. Alright. I wish I could get to hear big, though. Because I don't believe there's any power up. I know it's hippopotamus. Like, I complain a lot about not enough power-ups, and here I am, but I've never been... For someone who's played as much Mario as I, I've never been a particularly good level designer. That's just the truth. I, like, I feel like I should have leaned way more on the weird visual and not try to make it... Like, I just honestly still believe this looks pretty cool, and as a self-hating artist that hates everything I do, I feel like there's a certain amount of weight to the amount of praise I'm giving myself. 
But boy is it spammy for absolutely no reason. Yeah, not sure what happened. The lullaby for a few years. Probably still to this day, honestly. Is probably one is like is probably my major opus. Like it's my masterpiece. Everything I've done boils down into the lullaby. How did that eat you? I'll miss everyone. How about that, huh? How about that? Just miss everyone instead. I miss you so much like a lily pad. I don't know what that means. You know, everyone has a memory lily pad somewhere for memory purposes. Like, what is up with the spammy nature and everything? It's just love frogs everywhere. Hey, want projectiles to dodge? How about enemies that pop in? How about let's just make the level an auto scroller for no reason? So every time you gotta replay this, you gotta replay through an auto scroller. Now, because I knew this was gonna be part of the of a, of a multi multi level thing, which tend to be marathonic in nature. If there's anything anyone wants to play during a marathon, it's a nose pass. I don't know where the floor is. That's that's how good this okay here like the prima chow pattern does kinda tell you where the floor's at. I don't know, like I genuinely mean it. When I think that I got thrown off by the guy that hopped up, but then he just ended up on the ceiling. I got played. Alright, take your time. In the Midnight Express. In the cyber tunnel to Canada and the universe. Make sure to bring your salad. Make sure to bring your onion rings. Make sure to bring everything that makes you you. I got hurt like a dumb. That I did. But we can still see the window of your soul. Uh, shoot. Uh, yeah. Okay. Boppo. If you like flickering hearts, man, I have the level for you. Wait, this dips? Ah! <sighs> Yo! Two hits, buddy! I mean, we'll see if it lasts. But still, exciting. A little bit. A little bit! I'm gonna waste them is the problem. <laughs> like, let's be honest. Let us be honest about our sins. May flag imitation is not a sin. May tag imitation. See? Wasted. Completely wasted. Him. I don't know why jumping on moles is to this day a weird problem for me. Like, it happens very often, and I just miss him. I think it's because they move weird. They have a very unique speed, too, for this game. Uh, well, but I know it's possible to get here technically with two hits, though. It's just about being slow and meticulous. Like, it's not the most interesting one. Uh, but it becomes a lot more interesting when you realize it could be key to, like, actually beating this. What? Uh, man, well, that happened. Like, remove 80% of the sprites in this level. And this is genuinely probably the best Mario World anything I've ever done. But you do have to cull away, like, 80% of everything going on here. Man, I- ah, uh, if I didn't waste my hurts. Oh, man. So close. That's what makes it tragic. It's so close. Alright, here it's just these. Uh, here it dips. That guy's up there. Yeah. It's 
some of these are just there to scare you, it feels like. Ah, it's so close to something so good. Hi, I got just like all these frogs. I don't know what to do with them. So I just kind of put them all here. Cyber donut! And then a flying guy. Why? Are they generated? Why? Rauke! What are you doing? What is wrong with you? I swear. Everything you hate, you keep putting in yourself all the time. It's like, ugh. Is an encounter with some kind of fruit roll up enthusiast necessary? Double sprite glitch right at the end! I'm pretty sure that's right at the end. We're <sighs> gonna have to farm for life soon. Yay! Two hits down the neighborhood. Let's see where this goes. Let's see where this goes. Like, a lot of my hits are incidental, accidental. There's like one really hard part, and it's the part with the like opaque square with like a, a scar down the middle. Look at that, there's so much sprites that like they don't even get all their hearts out. Yeah, there's that opaque square with a big, like, scar that goes through. That's, like, the one, like, hard part. Where I get hit a lot, because there's just a lot to deal with. And you don't see all of it very good, because, you know, there's the whole visibility gimmick here. Like, here. Keep getting hurt by things. I think it's that fish and that mole there. All right, this is a good sign. Here we go. Although, man, isn't it sad that I feel like this is my peak and smooth, and it's like one of the first things I've done? I mean, yeah. I feel like I just got to the essence of me. Pretty early on, like, I just, I figured it out real early. All right, I'm here big, which is, ooh. This is very interesting. Share with your friends. Here's the donut shop. Here's the donut cop. Now, thing is, it's fun being big, but I am a bigger target, too. So, you know. You know, is big means big. Ah! Big means pain. Um. Yeah, look how bad the frame rate is. All right, that's just a single one here. I just what? Oh, well here you we get a yay. All right. Wait, is that a pop-up yay cut? Not cutscene, but midpoint. Because if so, I might just end today. <laughs> well, uh, and so we meet. Allow me to introduce myself, I am a King Charles IV. I got a giant Xbox thing, but you're just a Charlie guy. Yeah, that's right, he's got a helmet and he put, he put a crown on it, that's funny. Actually, whoa, did you see how everything like blah 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 there? Yeah, that's, that's my verb now. I love how he interrupts her <laughs> all the time. Dude just won't shut up, and it's a fun character trait. But yeah, the screen's kind of, like, jigging out. I guess that's just because, you know, old emulators versus now. Yeah, here's Heavy Swamp from Cave Story. Um, you gotta do that, and then you get homing guys. Because you always have to have homing guys in this game. He's just, he just owns this game, apparently. He's everywhere, like, you know? He, he, ah, and I jump right up into him like an idiot. And then, yeah, they pile up if you let them. This fight is, like, so not fun. Because it's just... Check it out! It's homing guy! It's bad old homing guy! He's homing and he's bad and he's full of very sad... Okay, what's up with that pop-up one-up? I'm making a face right now, like I was a YouTube thumbnail. So... 
I understand this correctly. You just dump me right here, and I can just press start. Alright, it's fine. I'm, I'm, I don't want to play anymore. I'm done for the day. Because I gotta save here. Wow! That changes everything! <laughs> you should have put like a moon... A moon fake entrance for uh... Between, between, between the rounds and the first part then. Or if not a moon, at least a dragon on. Like there's no dragon coins in the... Well, whatever, I'm not complaining. Dude, like, this took an hour to do two segments. <laughs> this is pretty hard. Alright, oh. So, hey. This is gonna have to do two bosses in a row, maybe. I don't know. I don't know anymore. I'm gonna farm for lives. Yeah. Ending the video.